Did somebody say flamingos? Okay, I got you. flamingos so I've already had some flamingo stuff but I needed more so I'm just getting ready to show you a few things I think this is the last one that might come today I'm thinking about my centerpieces right now just trying to figure it out you know flamingos when you think flamingos you think tropical you think um oh candles yeah, colorful, tropical, um, bright, pink, fruity, all kinds of things, you know. So I came up with a few ideas and I'm getting ready to see what they're going to look like. I have a few days to get ready and plan my signature um, gold. We're going to do the pink and gold accessories i even got my glasses these came today these are so freaking cute do you see this look at that and they're plastic perfect perfect i'm so happy i actually thought they were lighter than this color but this color matches all my stuff just perfectly so i'm excited about that and they wasn't even expensive of course because it's amazon so i have some flamingo plates these are really cute i'm going to do the big leaf oh let me give you an example so this is one of my looks here that i'm going for let me see if i can hold that up this is one of my my looks i'm going for put that in the middle I think that's pretty cute, right? And then I have another idea in mind. I'm not sure, but I picked these up. Michaels is having a 75% off sale, y'all. Did you hear me? Michaels is having a 75% off sale. These little, you can use this for dips because I have a I have these. These are so cute. So this one rung up, I think. Okay, so the regular price is $12.99. I think this was probably like $3 and $1.50. That was it. Also, I was able to grab this big bowl, which would be nice for like a pasta or something. I'm not really required to bring all of this, but I want to just add some touches to my picnic. So, I think these would be a great touch for this type of thing picnic i have pink napkins i have to go with these but i'm gonna make it work my cloth ones didn't come in time they kept canceling on me i'm so upset about that let me show you this let me show you this so cute right the dollar tree had these and i grabbed these probably about six months ago grab it i'm so glad i did that and then i have all my pink flowers because when you think flamingo tropical you've got to have your flowers together let me show you something else i found and i'm so mad that somebody broke one but I only they marked it down so it was worth the steal but i got flamingo shot glasses y'all flamingo shot glasses those are so cute what else do i have oh yeah i have flamingo candles flamingo candles i have i have all sorts of stuff 
stuff I've been just grabbing here and there. I have the these. It's really cute. I got these for like a dollar at Michael's. I have, you know, that large. This is so cute. Put the drinks in with ice. I got this one at um, Michael's as well. I can't wait. This is going to be beautiful. I cannot wait. So, yeah, I just wanted to kind of show you guys what I had. I think I want to throw this color in there some kind of way. Yeah. Like, yeah. I think I can pull it off. It's pretty, too. I might throw a couple of pillows that might match this, but... So far, that's what I have. My pillows, I already have those together. This is just the, the extra stuff that I wanted to show you guys. So now I'm gonna get ready to work on these. I'm not sure which way I'm gonna go with it, but I have a couple of ideas for my centerpieces and I'll be back because I'm gonna put it together and I'm gonna come back and show you guys. Now, I love my centerpieces. They were made with clear vases. I added a touch of detail of some lemon artificial, added some water, flowers, and a flamingo. You know they say one person's junk can be another one's treasure. We found these. We spray painted them, added flowers, and of course, another flamingo. Isn't it darling? I just love it so creative yep that's me hello 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 so here we are another event this one will be flamingos i love flamingos i i am i am heading it sound like i was scratching i'm heading to sacramento to go set up this one i'm thinking it's going to be gorgeous you know, um, I'm going to stay out in SAC because I have to, it don't make sense to turn around and come all the way back home and then go all the way back to SAC. So I'm going to stay out in SAC and enjoy some me time, have some food and, you know, just explore some things, get me some time in while I'm out there. And yeah, we're going to make this a good day. Actually, we're going to make this a good weekend because I start back to work on Monday. Yeah, I do work too. Um, and yeah, so this will be my last event until I start work. And then I don't know, maybe I'll have some more things rolling in. Cause you never know. Once that ping go off in my phone, there's an event that's being scheduled, but hopefully I can get a few more summer events in before I start the indoor events. Um, people, a lot of people ask like, what are you going to do when it starts getting cold? Well, <laughs> people still have events, you know? events are all year round and don't count the picnic business out i know you guys have been seeing it all over tv where people are having the indoor picnics they're not always outside you can take it to a whole nother level and hopefully i can bring you that footage so you guys can see i want you to think outside the box okay we be so busy thinking inside the box we give up on certain visions that we might have i don't want you to do that it is doable it is possible and we're gonna do it so i'm gonna tap back in once i make it to sacramento and of course you're gonna watch me set up stay tuned now my client she had a very beautiful backyard it was big enough to just create magic right here i'm setting up the picnic table i'm doing under the patio and i have an assistant on the side helping me set up my tent um, they're going to be sleeping over, so that's why I'm staying in Sacramento. And here I am doing my balloon garland. I love the pretty colors. I mean, this one was just a happy all-together picnic for me. And can you imagine? She's turning 90. How blessed is that? This was definitely a pleasure. One of my best picnics ever that I really enjoyed the setup and my time. So you guys, pay attention. Ooh.